Hello everyone and welcome to Hot Date. This game I think is about dating a pug. I've uh, I've seen a lot about it online and when I was at PAX they were actually selling shirts with that pug on it. So, I don't know, I guess it's a, a well-known game. I was just browsing the internet and I, I came across it again. I was like, hey, that game, that game seems to be pretty popular. Let's give it a go. Uh, I don't even know how to start the game. Enter? There you go. Alright, my name's Brenda. Can we just get this over with? Name? Uh, Matt. My name is Matt. Matt, serious? <laughs> that doesn't even sound like a name. Whatever. Okay. That's fine. Um, you look lovely today. Just want you to know. Tell me something I don't know. Alright, alright, I will. Uh, these are all questions, so I can't tell you something you don't know. What do you do for work? I've always wondered, what do pugs do for work? Let's try it. I'm doing this right now. Are you not getting paid? <laughs> uh, so now we can ask all kinds of questions. We can ask our questions, do questions, would questions, have questions, and what questions. Are you someone who likes to listen to jazz records? I, I feel like this dog likes to listen to jazz records. Whoa, ho, I see you spotted my saxophone lips. I'm quite the virtuoso, as it happens. Ah, I heart Billy Holiday. Me too, love that guy. Wanna be in my band? What can you play? It's all about the sax. I'm all about the sax. Perfect, let's start a band. We can change the world. Want to change the world with me? Let's change the world together. Let's do it. One sax solo at a time. <laughs> and now I gotta move on to a new question. Well, would you live in a tent? Because I am a total, you know, tent kind of guy. And I want to go camping with you, if you know what I mean. Let's do it. Definitely not. I actually came this close to doing it once, but then I realized I don't hate myself. Same here. Same here. I was just checking to make sure you're not one of those freaking tent lovers. Well, Pug, have you ever been to space? Because I freaking love space pugs. No flipping way! Space travel? Really? Space travel? <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> Alright man, you know, whatever, if you don't like space travel, I don't know what could- Hey! Don't go- don't go giving looks like that, okay? You gotta look like you're enjoying yourself. What- what- do you believe in... Uh, miracles? Where are you from? You sex thing, you sex thing, now. Try that. Never known any reason not to. Oh, really? No, you, you haven't known any reason not to believe in miracles. Have you ever witnessed a miracle? No? Okay. You're entitled to your beliefs, you stupid idiot. I agree with you. Shameful stare. Stop oppressing me with your narrow perspective, heathen. <laughs> Do you believe in... No, I already did that. Do you have a happy place? My happy place is within. Deep in the annals of my consciousness. It's a place. It's a state of mind. That's time! Uh, I had a great time tonight. I'd like to see you again kind of thing, you know what I'm saying? Oh, you sweetie. Take care, Matt. Hi there. Um, I'm Er Dave. It's kind of a dumb name. <laughs> you probably have a cool name. What is it? Okay, so is this a different pug or is this the same pug again? Are we supposed to go through it and then find out what the pug does and doesn't like? Blah, blah, blah. Are we supposed to go through this and find out what the pug does and doesn't like and then, uh, you know, manipulate that pug into loving us? Perhaps. Perhaps this time my name is Bob. Is Bob a fake name you give on dates? Mine was. <laughs> um, how's it going? How you doing? It certainly is. Okay. Cool. Uh, what do you do for fun? I've been interested in researching sub-Saharan African animation for a long time, so probably that. You? Uh... Bestiality? Cool! <laughs> kinda. I mean, it is kinda cool, depending on what you're into. They sighed at me. Good. Do you believe in miracles? I just wanna know that, okay? Not only do I believe in it, I harbor a deep and complex loathing for it. Okay, I agree with you. How about that? Oh, really? Don't tell me you were trolling me. I was just kidding. Damn it, I hate you, dog. I hate you so much. Okay, uh, would you like to see my collection of denim jackets? Oh, that's so cute. You're adorable. Good, just adorable. I like that. 
Okay, I would like nothing more than to gaze upon your collection of denim in jacket form. What is your favorite animal? Let's see, I'm gonna say Mermit. Oh yeah, Mermits, Mermits are the greatest. I need more, I need to, I need to do something else. Are you familiar with uh, the Gito Boys? Are you familiar with the Gito Boys? I want you to know that I'm disgusted by that question. I really don't care about Gito Boys. Okay, I'm sorry, I don't even know what they are, so. Oh, time is up already, really? I didn't do anything. I never want to see you again, please fuck off. Okay, I'm gonna go with uh, Clarence. My name is Clarence, nice to meet you. Serious, that doesn't even sound like a name. Whatever, it's true. I mean, Clarence, it almost sounds like Clarinet. Not really the greatest of names. No offense, Clarence, in the comment section. Love you. Uh, let's go with, uh, you look lovely again. Likewise, Chuck. Yes, but my name is Clarence, not Chuck. You might want to get that one right. So, like, uh, what are your hobbies? What do you like to do? Well, I've always done a lot of shooting hoops, but I'm not sure if I actually find it fun still. What about you? Hmm, I'll tell you. I like, uh, uh, Horse racing, maybe? Neat. Okay, cool, good. Do you believe in horoscopes? Believe in that sh damn straight, don't you? Surely you agree with me. Uh, this could be one of those trolling things again, I don't know. Uh, I agree with you? Oh. Really? I was just kidding. Awkward. Okay, would you live in a tent? Let's just ask the tent question again. I don't think anyone would ever choose to live there. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. For some people, it just chooses them. Oh, okay. All right. I, I, I still don't know how to get a good date going on here. Would you like to hear a joke? I got lots of funny jokes. I'm already looking at one. Whoa. Okay. Pipe down and listen up, you son of a bitch. Literally. Let's do this. Come on. Come on. What do you call a big pile of kittens? Or what did the whale made of wood eat? What did the whale made of wood eat? Huh? Just, 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 just. Plankton. It was plankton. Yeah, <laughs> cause plank and planks is wood and stuff. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know what I'm doing here, guys. I really don't know. Let's meet up again. Can we meet up again? Yep, bye. Name Neil. I mean, that's my name. My name. Ha 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 ha. What's yours? Name I mean. Mm, I'm gonna go with... Bentley. Bentley. My name is Bentley. So cute. Bentley is in my top three favorite names. Oh, yeah. Bentley representing the good names up in here. All right, it's nice to meet you. Right back at you, kid. Good so far. No, Nothing bad happening on this date. So where'd you go to school? School's always good. I didn't. I taught myself the essential life skills when I was living in a cave. Holy shit. Bear freaking grills over here. Okay, bear grills. Let me, let me ask you something. Have you ever ran half a marathon? Because, I mean, you lived in a cave. Why not just run marathons while you're at it? Nothing else to do. Typical. I'm sort of in a weird place with exercise. Of any kind right now. That used to be my favorite, but be my everything. Lately? Nuh-uh. What do you do for fun? You sort of have to be DJing. It's in your blood. Great. What do I do for fun? I like to, um, uh... I'm a monster truck driver, okay? That's what I do. I drive monster trucks. Me too! We've got so much in common, baby! Holy shit, this date is doing good. Are you a fan of... Keeping exotic pets as animals? Hmm? I want you to know that I'm disgusted by that question. Exotic creatures is definitely not in my top 10 faves. Well, I mean, I, I, me neither, obviously. So what annoys you? Oh geez, this is a vast expanse of inquiry. An endless plane of possibility. Top of the list. Flim flammery. Irrelevant protection of ethics and things. Council tax. Overly verbose anthropomorphic animals and happy endings. And they're the ones I'm prepared to share. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. You sound like a real great person. Uh, so are you having a nice time? Definitely. Yeah, definitely having a nice time. Good. Well, do you um, do you have a bucket list? Do, do, do you have a list in a bucket? I got a bucket of lists. That's pretty much what I said. They're all bucket lists. I've got ambition, son. Okay, what's top of the list? I need to know more about you. Rollerblading across Australia. All right, that sounds like a great way to get kicked by a kangaroo, but I'm not judging. I had a great time tonight. I just want you to know that. It was absolutely magical. Ew, gross, leave. Well, I guess, I guess this is like,
okay. Okay, let's date one more dog and then we'll call it a night. Hey dude, people call me Meg. What up, what's your name? My name is Bartholomew, okay? The greatest of all the names, is that how you spell it? Close enough. Is Bartholomew a fake name you give on dates? Mine was. Yep. Yeah, it was. Tell me a bit about yourself. Come on. Give me some of that. Oh, well, Meg, that's my name anyway, if that's what you wanted to know. I have wicked blast beat skills. I'm fluent in Punjabi. And I'm also a qualified something or another. What else? I'm a lifelong Backstreet Boys fan. What else can I tell you? I run my own spin class. What else can I tell you? I've got four gold teeth. I hate them. What else did you want to know? Nothing after all the information you just gave me, but, um, where did you grow up? What's it to you? Maybe I didn't. Maybe I was always this age. Pugs, man, they got sass. Maybe it was my own company. Okay, well, I mean, do you have any special skills? I believe I hold a high level of commercial awareness, which helps me to achieve profitable growth in a competitive market. I'm also sick at crafting marionettes. Alright, you definitely have that thing going for you, stud. Let's try that. Well, I have been training for quite some time. All right, and what is your favorite German loan word? The hell's a German loan word? Uh, I don't think I know any. Do you think I'm dumb? No, sweetie. No, I don't. Well, whatever. Who cares? Oh, don't be so hard on yourself. Come on. Are you uh, are you having a nice time? I want you to have a nice time with me. No, I don't even think that's relevant. Jesus, this is one depressed pug. Have you ever been to Kilimanjaro? Very nice place, very tall. Oh sweet, basically since I was born my life has revolved around walking. It's my world. All right, that's, that's fine, I guess. Have you ever read the uh, Lolita? I feel comfortable enough around you to say I actually have a tattoo of books about pedophiles. I can't really show you right now. <laughs> Great. I've never actually read Lolita, but just from the sounds of it, it sounds like a pedophile book, so that's cool. Would you live in um, Portland, Oregon? Because I, I really want to move to Portland, Oregon. I'm looking for a, a beautiful wife to take with me. I don't think anyone would ever choose to live there. You're absolutely right. But I have to. It's not my fault. Oh, it chooses them. Yeah, of course. And then Portland, Oregon chose me, and I want you. I've chosen you to be with me in Portland. Yeah? All right, never mind. Do you like me? Come on, please. Come off it. Never. Well, fuck you. Can I ask something mean? Uh, are you a fan of recent episodes of The Simpsons? Nobody's a fan of the recent episodes of The Simpsons. You mean, the oh, okay, time is up. Didn't even get to read that. I never want to see you again. Okay, you are a complete buzzkill and you turned down my whole Portland, Oregon thing, I'm pretty sure, so just go away. I actually agree with you for once. Great. Alright guys, well I'm gonna end this video here. I'm pretty sure this game is exactly what you'd expect from a pug speed dating game, I guess. So I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.